For the first time, we're hearing from the victim's family members as they mourn the deaths of Clay Bethard and Paul Trapini. Police now say it started early Saturday morning with an argument about an unwanted advancement toward a woman inside the Dogwood Bar. That argument spilled into the street and led to a deadly stabbing that killed Clay Bethard and Paul Trapini. Paul's family sent us a statement that read in part, Paul Douglas had a heart of gold and the absolute best sense of humor, and his light of love will forever guide us and comfort us. The 21-year-old was planning to graduate from Rhodes College in Memphis next year and go to law school. Clay was a standout football player at Battleground Academy who went on to play at several colleges. In a statement, his family said Clay was an amazing, big, and soft-hearted human being with an undeniable love for the Lord. Last night, we also heard from NFL players close to the Bethard family. Clay's brother, CJ, is also a Battleground Academy graduate and now a backup quarterback for the San Francisco 49ers. The team dedicated its win last night to the Bethard family. An hour with CJ last night. And just being with him during that, um, you guys you guys know how tough it was, is for him and his family right now. I'd like to just um, send my love to the Bethard family, um, him and CJ and just their whole family. Um, just a terrible thing to happen to such an incredible family and an incredible person. Police say a third victim, A.J. Bethram, was taken to the hospital with eye and arm injuries. Officers say he continues to recover tonight. In the newsroom, Eric Hilt, News Channel 5.